So what you saying? Money. Get out my business. Okay. Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Hero. That's Eric. Uh, we are the amalgamation of the identity booth and on occasion we like to talk to you guys about things that we find oh so annoying um there's no secret or love lost here i worked for a police department i worked as a police officer i worked as a forensic uh pathologist technician and examiner and i have no love lost when i say police are the scum of the earth um i say this understanding that this doesn't go for all officers but if you feel offended by that comment i'm talking to you Mm. But for what it's worth, we do like to see our justice system actually incorporate justice into the system. Um, and in this rare situation, we have found ourselves talking about the St. Louis undercover officer who was in the St. Louis riots back when a plethora of black males were being shot down in the street by law enforcement. And this undercover officer found himself being assaulted by four of his own officers. Mm. And just with that headline, Eric, this happened in 2017. What are your thoughts on that? I just find it to be ironic. I'm sad for the for the the gentleman who sustained the injuries due to this assault by his quote unquote fellow brethren. Mm. Um, it's <laughs> it's just appalling to see these people were unaware of what they were getting themselves into but the but i do need to say for a second the bravery of the officer that did take this mm. uh, uh, assault and hopefully was able to heal because he risked his own life really to expose a greater yeah. problem that we've been talking yeah. about on this channel for the last three years that we just have poor decision makers in these police forces i don't know what the problem is it's just this isn't difficult again we said it before i don't know how many times i have to say it doing the right thing isn't difficult mm. it's not that difficult mm. you guys just for some reason choose not to do it this is this is poor cognition at his at his at his absolute finest and it's the job of us here at the identity booth to point this out to you to inform you and let you know this is unacceptable and you need to raise some cane about it you need to you you have to because we need these things to change this stuff has to stop happening it, it it's just be, and they did it to a cop <laughs> well, now man. now if they would do it to a cop man. man they must not know first of all this guy is a cop second of all this guy probably fits a description of somebody that they would give a beat down to. <laughs> and for those of you guys who know me, who watch this channel, you know, yeah. I'm not, you guys know I'm not a wokey woke at all. But come on, this is pretty blatant. Yeah. He's a cop, but he doesn't have the <laughs> complexion for the protection. I'm sorry. It's just pretty blatant to me. And we got to call a spade a spade. They had absolute disregard for his life. Because they had a prejudice against him already without even knowing him. You know, Hero, I think we need to get some shirts that, that say content of my character over color of my skin. Because people aren't even giving this guy an opportunity to show what kind of character he is. And as, as a matter of fact, he has so much character that he got his face beat in as a black police officer <laughs> going undercover to find out if the officers that he's serving with are actually men of character the and i have some i have some stats for this so he has suffered irreversible damage to his neck he had at the time of the beatdown, his lip was so swollen he could insert his whole pinky into his lip he had 14 teeth dislodged he had a fractured jaw and several bruised ribs and also has an irregular spine curve that put him on that platform so he was taking a risk at that and a lot of people have reached out and said some things of the lander because you know people are cowards people are cowards and i want you to remember this because remember the at this moment when they were like why come he didn't announce that he was a cop and the reason he why was he was undercover and 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 that should go without saying but moreover it's because he didn't want the people who were with him protesting to also be identified as being undercover and thus causing a commotion. So he played the role and to the part. And a lot of people are saying, Eric, Eric, calm down. 
you're reaching okay these officers made a mistake they owned up to their mistake they're in, they've been arrested he got paid five million dollars this has nothing to do with race eric do you know what my response to them is going to be oh i know what it is but we we're not going to say it because we want the algorithm to be nice to us today okay <laughs> then i'll say it in the most polite way i can i bet you didn't know who this black officer's partner was uh-oh. I bet you also didn't know his partner was there at the protest, also undercover. Now, Eric, do you think his partner got arrested or beaten up? Nope. You want to take a guess 50-50 at what color his partner was? I'm pretty sure uh, I can I can guess, but let's help the audience who's probably not as, as quick as some of us are. It's about as white as this goddamn smile, baby. Look at it indulge yourself motherfuckers <laughs> but you want to know the crazy part about it his partner was within five feet of him and the partner knew if he tried to interfere he would also have blown the cover but moreover he would have gotten his ass beat too because it's not really about race you're absolutely right jokes on you they will beat oppose oppress and dominate anybody they can if you are not the person paying them you are the person bleeding underneath them and that is yep. their purpose so this is a tragic situation he will be paid five million dollars if these officers are convicted there's four of them and you have to know that the that the their defense is you can't prove that these were the officers that beat his ass even though the size 11 and a half footprint left on his back matches perfectly with one of the assailants one of them was literally caught on camera and then the one who did who got caught because the officer could point him out in a lineup then snitched on the fourth person because there is no loyalty with amongst thieves right there who cares how this shit works yeah our point is just just take this shit away uh, peaceful yep. protesters shouldn't be harassed by officers don't and and this is this is also a, a fair warning to all the protesters out there because we had a video about how not to protest if you're going to yeah. protest in flip-flops single shirt no mask no no first date in your backpack you are not there to protest you are there for a live stream you are there to virtual signal you are there to make yourself seen and not heard and we don't need people to be seen that's what instagram's for you go to protest, you go like me, hoodied out, maxed out, knuckles wrapped, ready to brawl. Because I don't give a damn. Actually, I give a damn a little bit. I, I work in healthcare. <laughs> mm -hmm. But the truth be told, you, there's a way to do this. And we're, we're learning more and more over. Officers don't know what they're doing. But that's just our take on it. That's our perspective on it. We are interested to know what you think about this. Let us know how you feel about this. Do you think the officers had a bias in this? If the answer is no, go fuck yourself. But if the answer is yes, feel free to leave a <laughs> comment below and still go fuck yourself. See, I'm fair and balanced. You can't get mad at me. Eric, where can they find us? I'm fair and balanced. I'm fair and hey, balanced. They can find us right here on Twitch, man. Make sure you go hit that, hit that follow button. Do not turn the notifications off. Leave them on. We want to make sure that you know every time we're going live, every time we're posting comment right here on Twitch. Shout out to Twitch. That's Bay. Shout out to YouTube. That's the side piece. She's faithful, but she is a side piece. Shout out to the 427 people over there subbed and rocking with us over there. Make sure you go and hit that sub button over there. Get those notifications set to all. Then make sure you go hit that link tree. Anchor. Anchor is the place that's paying us pennies. And we appreciate those pennies. Right. Pennies turn to dollars, man. Dollars make sense to us. So. Yeah. Hey, make sure you go over there and click that link. Go over there and follow us over there, man. Listen in your car. Listen when you're on the treadmill, the elliptical, when you're pressing them weights. We got a lot to say in a little bit of time, so rock with us. Yeah, here we, we definitely appreciate you guys coming through. Anchor, let me get my that Anchor link up in here. Just for yeah, yeah, man, show them Anchor I feel, love, I bro. Feel, I feel like Anchor, we should have an Anchor hotkey, man. Uh, why don't we have an Anchor hotkey? I don't know, bro. We need you guys one. take care of yourself, man. That's my fault. I, oh, I gotta do better. I gotta do better. Uh, put on your mask and uh, shut the fuck up, alright? Bye. Alright, next show. But it's so hard to find through the daily grind. We're working overtime. And I'm sleep deprived. Shorty on the line and we fuzz and fight. Seems like every night. Don't care who.
who's wrong or right I hope the end is like slower than